Hey everyone, Paul Akers. I'm going to show you a new product. This is the Flip Bolt Jig, now injection molded. It, it's awesome. It really is going to work well. I'm going to show you how to do it. Uh, for those of you who are not familiar with the Flip Bolt, it's basically a toolless countertop connector. It levers over instead of having a wrench and you're struggling underneath the countertop trying to connect them together. It's a great product. We have a long one and a short one, four and a half and three and a half inches long. And the jig also accommodates both sizes, the four and a half and the three and a single right there. So if you just wanna do one edge at a time, you just put it on like that. Now let me demonstrate how it works. It's very, very simple. You basically line it up on your seam and you get it pretty close. It really doesn't matter if it's off center because it still works fine, but get it close enough. Then take a couple three quarter inch screws right here and the, the pilot hole areas are already preset. So you just put that in and you put in four of them just to hold. Okay, now what we've got is a laminate trimmer. You can use a plunge router, you can use whatever you want, whatever's convenient for you. This is a half inch bit, three quarter inch deep with a ball bearing guide on the top, just like that. And I'm just gonna lightly plunge it over. You can do it any way you want. This is the way I'm gonna do it. If you don't like doing it this way, you can do it any way you want. You can use a plunge router, whatever. So simply plunge your router in, then route out the entire shape, making sure everything is open and clear so the flip bolt can be installed. And then when you get done, just vacuum it all out. You know, this is our new shop back hose system. It's just incredible. We have so many great products and our tip mag. And I'm using all fast cap products here. And of course, the screws go right on the magnet that goes on top of your screw gun. And then you just put the flip bolts in. Very easy. Just tighten them up just like you would a dog bone with your fingers. But instead of using a wrench, just flip it over and you're done countertops joined together just like that pretty simple pretty easy does a nice job you can knock it down to get it off but that came out perfect but look how strong that is just with two flip bolts just like that so you would obviously if you're doing a countertop put one there put one there you choose what you want to do but it's a great product the new jig is awesome it makes it very simple to do it and it's very creative you can also use a rub collar with it as well a lot of people have rub collars instead of this kind of bit whatever you think is best but the jig works great thanks a lot